Strictly Come Dancing will return to the BBC later this year with the judging panel and professionals having already been confirmed. While the official lineup of celebrities taking part is yet to be confirmed, it has been claimed the show is in talks to sign up Amanda Abington. Amanda had started dating escapologist Jonathan Goodwin, who was left paralyzed in 2021 after a stunt on America's Got Talent, Extreme did not go to plan. A TV insider told The Sun, Amanda has had a rough ride over the past seven years and just recently has she come out the other side. The accident only brought Amanda and Jonathan closer together and she is keen to start a whole new chapter in her life. Part of that is taking part in Strictly because it's a long-held ambition of hers and one she is on track to fulfill before her milestone 50th birthday next year. She did once tease her desire to join Strictly as early as 2010, despite not being a fan of appearing on reality TV. She said, the only thing I'd love to do is Strictly come dancing. The curse of Amanda Abington strikes again. Don't miss. Carol Verderman's appearance leaves Emma celebrity viewers distracted. Discussion, GB News Eamon Holmes launches fresh attack on Meghan Markle. Video, Immerdale's Tom King star explains return as fans fear for Belle. Insight, I love the idea of learning something. This is an official application. But I'm sure me being on it would be its downfall. The curse of Amanda Abington strikes again. The BBC has not commented on the official Strictly Come Dancing lineup at this stage. The celebrities are not usually announced until the summer, with last year's names dropping in August. The judges this year have been confirmed as Craig Revel Horwood, Anton Dubeka. Matsi Mabuse, and Shirley Ballas. The professional dancers include Yovita Gistal, Gorka Marquez, Carlos Gu, and Vito Coppola. Strictly couple Nadia Beachkova and Kai Widrington are also back, along with Diane Buswell, Graziano De Prima, Amy Dowden, Karen Hauer, Katya Jones, Neil Jones, and Nikita Kuzmin.